everyone, welcome to my car. Today we will be on our way to the thrift store and I will just be chatting with you because yeah, and I'm gonna take you thrifting after and we're just gonna have a good day because why wouldn't we? It's a thousand degrees in New Jersey. Um, I'm sorry for everyone in the West because we're usually the colder state. <laughs> just trying to fix you guys. All right, so I don't know if it's even facing me. Like, I don't even know. I just know it's extremely unstable. Stop. All right, I've made a con contraption and I don't know if it's one still recording or facing me. You guys could, for all I know, be facing the street. For all I know. Does anyone care? Yeah, also, I love you guys because I'm putting you on my bad side. My right side is my bad side, but it's fine. So, a little bit about the thrift store we're going to. It's a church and all the money is donated to their soup kitchen that they do every Wednesday or Thursday night and it's all in cash. Dresses are $3. Suits are $3. Everything else is a dollar, I think, or $2. There are tags for every week. And they do go in order of oldest to newest. So the oldest thing, whatever, you guys will see. You'll, you'll be fine. You'll be fine. You're just going to come along. You're going to love it. And you're going to have a lot of fun. And you better leave feedback because I am not sure if I'm going to find good things. So you tell me if it's worth it's worth it. Because it's cash only, guys, I'm gonna try to keep a limit to how much I can spend. So I'm gonna take like 30 or $20 inside the store with me so I can have a little bit of self-control without going too much. Unless I find something insane, I'm gonna ask them to keep it for me and I'll go out and get cash for reference the same thrift store i found a michelle watch that i sold for 320 dollars and i bought it for three dollars so there are gems in this store there are a lot of gems hey there are a lot of gems but you just have to play the game you have to be a player to play the game that's that's all you gotta do but it's like a thousand degrees outside and this girl's wearing a sweatshirt talk about teenagers in the middle of the road honey that's good i don't have road rage but i think it is genetic for everyone that lives in jersey or new york so it, if you live in jersey or new york you're just born with road rage but if you like immigrated here it's kind of like nature versus nurture definitely nurture i'm definitely feeling the anger vibes i it's like contagious what But yeah, I'm gonna do a haul. I'm gonna do a haul later, you guys. And I'm so excited. I feel like my head is cut off. Is my head cut off? Who knows? That's what happens when you cheap out and just record everything with your iPhone. <laughs> because you're a broke college. Yeah. I'm gonna do a haul. Maybe a try on. Let's not go crazy, guys. Let's not go crazy. Maybe a try on. But definitely a haul of everything I get. And last time I went, I did find a dress. For, I got it for $2 or $3. And that dress I cut. So I made it into a top. And it was a French connection dress. So the material was amazing. It just had weird balloon shaped skirt. Like the second half of the dress. So I just cut it and I put rhinestones on the top part. And it looks great, let me tell you. I look like I came out of Disney. You're gonna love it. I'm gonna wear it and I'm gonna tag it in the Insta in the Instagram. In the Instagram. And I'm gonna let you guys know if I like it. Cause I don't think, I don't know if I like it. I just got the rhinestones from the dollar store. Cause that's, that's you know, like, yeah. So we'll see. Now that I think about it, I feel like I should have bought the rhinestones for a little bit more. But then the rhinestones would be more expensive than the actual shirt. So I don't know if it's worth it. 
it was two dollars worth of rhinestones but it's all colorful it has a lot of different shapes very cute so yeah so i'm gonna tag it and i'm gonna make sure i let you guys know that that's the shirt from the video i can't wait to show it to you guys maybe i'll wear it to like one of the 500 engagements this year okay yay it's open by the way this thrift store only opens like two or three days a week so there should be some good things trying to park doing some uh, like k turns <laughs> on my right driver's instructions everybody all driver instructions leave a comment below all driver instructions instructions drive all driver instructors leave a comment below telling me your favorite color alrighty guys I'm here I'll see you inside I'll see you inside
I got a bunch of things and they're all in this bag. And I got something here for me after I purchased everything. These knives are the brand Cutco and it is a very expensive brand and I decided I'm gonna buy them because it's a set of eight and it retails for $400 so I just decided to buy them whether I wanna sell them or if I just wanna keep them for my house. They're brand new and they are in perfect condition. Well, of course, because they're brand new. And yeah, it's from New Kensington, Pennsylvania so support local business. I'm just kidding. You bought them at the thrift store so that's not mean anything. All right, and now they're all jumbled in here. Just the wood, I was so attracted to this wood, and I was like, wait, there must be something really nice inside. So I went and I looked, and it was only $5. Whether I sell or keep it, it's a win-win, so that's good. Next up, I got this Tumi Tummy Tech bag. It is perfect for traveling, it's perfect for selling. Either one, it re retails for a lot because Tumi is a really expensive brand and a lot of people who are working overseas or just going to work every day, they need a bag like this, so it, it would sell. I just might keep it, I have a vision for it, so I might keep the bag. It was a dollar. Oh, I forgot to tell you, I tried recording almost everything in the store, but it was a little tough. There was a lot of workers or a lot of people. I didn't want to expose anyone. I didn't want to put anyone's face in it. So excuse me if I had just put a little bit of things like here and there. But overall, it was a really good day. I spent about $30. It may seem from the videos that I found nothing because there are a lot of clothes, but that's what thrift stores are all about. You just find that one thing that really attracts you and you just buy it. So yeah, I got a bunch of things. I got this white dress. I will not do a try on today. It is extremely hot and I just have a lot of studying to do. <laughs> So it might just be tough for me to try on and take off and try on and take off and show you guys, but, 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 on Instagram, there is a very big possibility that I will be doing this try on, whether it be a post or a story, and I will make sure to highlight and it stays. So you guys check over, check over, check over my Instagram. Go to my Instagram, check it out. It's stress dressed and it's really great. So yeah, I, I might just do a try on of the item. So this is a white dress. It's so pretty. It's beautiful. I really like it. I'm definitely gonna wear it at some point because I'm getting married. So when else do you wear white? I don't know. Let me know. Let me know in the comments below. I got this dress because you can never have enough dresses. It's Gap. It's an X small, so it's perfect for me. It's open from the bottom, so it's like a triangle. <laughs> it has pockets, so that's a plus. I'm very glad. And it's cotton. It has an eyelet in the back. So I will not be selling this. I will be keeping this for the summer and maybe sell it afterwards. It was also a dollar. The dress was $6, but it was worth it because if I buy it on Poshmark, it would still be a lot. Okay, next up, I got this Limit the Limited shirt. I really like the sleeves and the bottom, so that's why I bought it. I think it's really cute for a night out. A cute date with my... Okay. I also like that it's like a bit of a square top. It's not the best quality, but that's the Limited for you. It's fine. It's fine. Okay, next up, I got this Lanvin wallet. Don't get too excited. It's a bit worn out but I think I can have like a purpose for it I can cut it out I can do something with it but this leather is really nice I can clean it up and sell it there's just a lot of things I can do with this wallet it's just very expensive so I decided to buy it it was a dollar next up I got the skirt it's super cute I think this is a tennis skirt yep Wilson tennis and it comes with a button it is my size and it's very short so it's probably best to keep it for the winter oh yeah it's definitely a tennis skirt. It's probably best to keep it for the winter and wear stockings under it, so that would be perfect. I don't mind. Good to go. Okay, what I'm most excited about, can't wait to show you guys, is this. This is from Egypt. When I went to Egypt, I bought a bunch for my friends and I never got one for myself. And this is exactly what I wanted. This was a dollar. And in Egypt, it sells for a lot. I don't know if it's, they treated us like tourists or if it just sells for a lot. Next, I got this fossil beautiful watch there's a lot of oysters around that i don't know if you can see so this is definitely very expensive it's all leather and it is very beautiful i don't believe they do this anymore and i might keep this just because of how pretty it is but i also might sell it i don't know we'll see okay next up i got this gucci bracelet for the oh this was a dollar this is a dollar I don't know if this is real i'm gonna have to do my research but i'll get back to you guys about the authenticity but it is very cute I mean, the less you know, the better, but I do think it's real. 
just because it's been scratching and nothing has happened to it. So this might be Rio and I might sell it. Next up, I don't know if these are earrings or cufflinks, but this is pure gold. And I can tell because there's a lot of scratching on it and it has it, it's not gold plated even. It's just pure gold. I don't know if you can see it or if it's even focused on it. But if they are cufflinks, Thomas, this one's for you. But if they're earrings, I just have to do my research. I have to figure out what these are, but these are gold got them for a dollar okay next up i got these cute earrings i like the bag they're so cute these are jade or that's at least what the lady said these are really pretty earrings i'm gonna wear them and i'm gonna like them and they're gonna be mine and i got these for a dollar yeah they're not the best quality they're i just really like the color can you see i don't know if you can see but i just i really like the color okay next up oh yes this beauty Okay, I got this necklace. I don't know what this necklace entails. I don't know how I feel. I don't know if it's real even. I don't know if it's Van Cleef, but it is a beautiful, a beautiful necklace. I think I'm gonna wear it at some point in my life and I'm gonna double wear it like, a, like, like this. Does that make sense? I'm gonna wrap it around twice so that it can look like it's layered. And it does say on here that it's made in Schiff. No, Marley's Schiff. So this is probably not a brand. This is probably fake. And I just bought a fake necklace. And that's fine. We all make mistakes. This was a dollar. I'm still gonna wear it. But I do have to wear it only at events and not forever. Like this necklace, I can wear it anytime, any day, whatever. But this one, unfortunately, I don't think I can. But I'll let you guys know. Go over to my Instagram. I will make updates and I'll take pictures of all of this and I can even upload it for you guys so you can see everything I bought. This was, once again, $30, $29 to be exact. $30 I just round up. And I can sell one of those items and get that money back. But I don't think I'll be doing that until a bit later. So it is still a good investment. I'm very happy with all the purchases. I can't believe I found Lane Van Gucci and all of those things in the church next to my house. So yeah, I'm very happy. And make sure you guys subscribe, like, comment, because it helps me a lot. I am trying to read 1,000 subscribers before summer ends. And I think I can only do it with you guys. So please make your way over to the subscribe button. I can not speak today please make your subscribe button subscribe and like and comment i love you guys and i will see you next tuesday